If you got a flat tire recently and you're thinking whether you should patch up your tire or plug it in, this video might help you decide which course to take when you're in that situation. So if you decide to patch your tire, usually it costs more as the mechanic has to go inside the tire and use special tools to patch up the hole in your tire. But if you still have warranty on your tires, it might cover nail damage. So you can get the patch done for free. But if your tires warranty expired and you don't feel like spending extra money to get your flat tires patched up, definitely a plug kit tool is a must have with you to repair your tire. So if you decide to go that route, the only places you should be plugging the tire is within the crown of the threads and you don't want to repair any holes that are in the sidewall of your tire as they're not reinforced with the steel belts as much as the middle treads are. And what's great about using the plug kit is you can store it in your car, it doesn't take up any space and if you find the hole you can just plug it in from the outside and you don't have to go inside the tire to do patch repair or anything you just come outside and you plug it in it's done snip off the bud and the tire will reinflate again no problem these things are usually pretty cheap under 20 bucks where tire patches usually cost about 50 bucks and up to do so definitely cheaper to get the tire plug and they work really great so if you also get the vulcanizing glue with the rope strip it'll do it'll give an extra seal on the barriers on the outside of the rope so there's no extra moisture that can leak into the tire and your tires can even last probably two years or longer continuous driving and since tires usually wear out within two years, it's pretty much good enough. Of course, another time when not to count on using a plug kit is if you got a flat tire and you've been driving it too long, maybe for five minutes, the rims will start to eat the inside of your rubber. So even a tire plug kit is not gonna really help because your tire is already compromised and it could blow up at any moment on the road so this doesn't really solve the issue and that's why you need to have a tire inflator with you in case you ever get a flat tire so if you ever see the TPMS light come on your dash you know you should check right away to see if you got a flat tire and then you can plug in the portable inflator and inflate your tire before it gets too low and before you do too much damage to the inside of the rubbers. Plus, how often do you see people on the side of the road with a flat tire? That actually can damage your rim and start to bend it in. So that's why you want the tire inflator. Quickly inflate the tire and then as long as you do that and you plug in your tire, then you'll have no issues there. So there you go. Tire plug kits are a good alternative to use. You don't want to get the patch done. It's more cheaper. It does a pretty good job of sealing your holes and you don't have to worry about anything for a good two years driving. It's a really solid solution to have. So now you know what to do the next time you get a flat tire.